Hello, everyone. <laughs> I'm Rachel Tessman from StampYourArtOut.com. I'm an independent Stampin' Up! demonstrator from Andover, Minnesota in the U.S., and I'm here to bring you one of my live paper crafting classes. This is Terry Phelps. She's my friend. <laughs> Yay, Terry came. She's um, a demonstrator, a sister demonstrator of mine. So where are you from? What city? Venice Heights. Venice Heights. Okay. So um, she's here to help me. Because I still have my hand injury. So yay, yay, yay. <laughs> ah, fun times, <laughs> right? Good. Anyways, if you have not been to my blog before, this is the name of my website, stampyourartout.com. You just click on blog and you can get all kinds of fun ideas. I try to share three to four times a week. Um, I had some hand surgery for those of you that are new to my videos or new to my whatever, my lives. Um, I had hand surgery about almost two weeks ago now. And it's healing, but I'm still in this, like, uh, this got put on yesterday. This is like a little contraption that prevents me from moving my fingers or my finger too much. I had some surgery on the cartilage that goes over the tendon on your middle finger. So it's the sagittal band area. And uh, I have my bandage on, although they want me to have it off, but I'm not going to let you guys see the grossness. The stitches came out yesterday, so at least like the little centipede look is gone, but yeah. <laughs> Anyways, thank you all for coming. Um, I am going to attempt to do some stamping as well, but Terry is here to help, and we're going to have fun creating a card. It's called a simple diorama card. We are going to be using products from the Lay Shops Suite in the annual catalog. So why don't I show that first here, and um, let's just bring this camera in. There we go. So this is the Lay Shop Suite, and um, you can see that there's a stamp set and the dies that match. Oops, can you see those? They're kind of down there. Oops, and then up here are sequins. So let's show the actual products. And I'll move this out of the way. Cute. It is. I love all the scenery that you can I do. Know. And I love how I just love things like lampposts and the you know, details. This is a detail of extra fun things you can add. Yeah, the dyes. We'll bring those in. You can see what details she's talking about. But totally great for scenery cards. So let's uh, bring in those products. We'll grab this stamp set and the dies as all of my little products are flying all over the place. <laughs> there we go. So, do you have this, by the way, this suite? Um, this one, I actually don't. Okay, but Which, you want it, don't you? Because yes, it's so it's cool. Like, I have, I have like 90% of this catalog <laughs> and the mini. It's just, it's a sickness, as my husband would say. Oh, it's a healthy sickness, though. <laughs> I know, right? You know, yeah. Yeah, I mean, if you're going to have an addiction, it's way healthier than some, than oh, some of the other sure. things out there. <laughs> Plus, we make cards and we yeah. gift them to people, and it makes everybody feel good, right? That's, that's right. So fun to see names <laughs> chiming in on the comments. Hello, everyone. Oh, my gosh. Familiar names. Hi, Kim. <laughs> All right. So you can see that there are some sentiments that come with this set. This is a set, though, that I supplemented with another stamp set because I wanted to have um, some more options for sayings. Um, but we do have a happy birthday in there. You're so sweet kind of thing. Like you're such a sweet treat. Um, wish we were here. Let's get together. Good luck. And then these other sentiments or whatever the words are in here to identify the different buildings that are in. Yeah, that's so cool. Right? So you could make a bookstore, <laughs> a, book a bakery. Oh, there's a hello. Sorry about that. Yeah. Yes, fun. So fun. These are lights. They're not hangers. I thought they were hangers that you put clothes <laughs> on, but they're lights that actually go into these little windows here. Because that is the thing you look for when you go somewhere, right? Is is there a place to hang my stuff? <laughs> <laughs> right. On the storefront, you can make it be like a bookstorefront. You can make it be... Um, bakery? Yeah, bakery. Um, plants. You could put plants in the window. It could um, be a little hotel even. Oh, it could I mean, be. you know, put your plants in your Yes, and you could, stuff. if you have Super handwriting cute. that you like, you could make this be whatever you want. You can always write a different kinds of kind of storefront in there. Let's say you own a store. Oh, my gosh. Oh, uh, yeah. A stamping store. Hello. Yeah. <laughs> or let's say you own, um, I don't know, what other kinds of stores are out there? A clothing store. So let's say you put, a boutique. you know, the name of your clothing store, and that could sit above the building, and then you could put your hangers in the window. Okay, anyways. <laughs> Um, so yeah, lots of fun dyes that go with it. You can see that there's some foliage. This here goes over like the window. Um, a couple dyes that are the same if you want to die cut multiple plants. 
This die cuts the window. So you can see, and oh, there's the lamp post. There's the lamp post and the bench. That's so oh, cute. Oh, yeah. We're going to be using the bench, and we're going to be using these guys. So we might as well take those off. I'm going to have you safely put them off to the side. Okay. Um, if you want to take the other foliage piece off of there and the lamp post, um, because we're going to be using those. So let's make sure They're we so save cute. those. They're so little. <laughs> I love it. And I'm going to shove that up and over there, and then we'll put this off to the side. The So Sincere is the stamp set that we're going to use to supplement. Um, so this is the sentiment that I put on the finish card that you're going to see on my blog post when this video appears on my website. Again, stampyourartout.com. At 4 p.m. Central Time today, you'll be able to click on the link that's in the description of the video. So if you're watching on YouTube, the link is already there, but it's not active. At 4 p.m., you'll be able to click on it and you will be able to see this video again um, if you want to. And then the stamp, the card that I created before the video um, has this on the back. But we're going to be using the Let's Go Shopping for the words on the card we're making today. But look at how all of these, I, all of these great choices. Uh, I love the font. The font. They're oh, so, I mean, it's just so pretty. And look at it's, that. Yeah, isn't that fun? Mm -hmm. it's, so, it's refreshing. You know, it's, it, yeah. it's different. It's, it's not different the same and old, you know. Very artsy. Yeah. So this stamp set is in the mini catalog, which is the September through December mini catalog. And um, it covers yeah. everything. It does. I mean, that's the thing that's so great about it because you can use it. Yeah. You, all I mean, year round. It's just like for you. Everything. Hello, that covers everything. And happy birthday. You got to have happy birthday sentiments. We'll put that one off to the side because we won't be using that on today's card, but we will be using the other stamps. Okay, before we start, you guys, I just want to remind you that this was the video that I did two weeks ago before the day before my surgery. Um, I did that card. I'm going to zoom in a little bit here. Oops, my arm. There you go. You get to see my arm. Um, it's a <laughs> square column fold card and it sits up like this so you can have it on display. And what I did afterwards is I had already had this made before my surgery. And I created wow. one with the Splendid Day suite of products. I love that suite, too. It's so uh, pretty. And I thought so that this was going to be difficult to stamp. It's um, not. No. It isn't. No, I really thought, like, my ink pad would be too juicy for it. But you ink it up and stamp it down, and you get that same look that it's that it shows yeah. on the stamp set cover, which is great. So this was the stamp or the card that I made after. It folds to either direction. So if you want to fold ah, it flat sorry. for going in an envelope or all the way open so you can write in it with your left non-dominant hand, <laughs> you could do that. And then I'm so proud of myself because two days ago, Terry, you're going to be so proud. <laughs> I made this one ah, with one I hand. It. I did it oh with one hand, God. you guys. That is so dang <laughs> cute. And it has a little wobbler on it. Granted, I didn't fussy cut anything. That's like really hard to do. Fussy cutting oh, yeah. and curling my hair and putting on my makeup and brushing. <laughs> it's an all day deal. Yeah. <laughs> putting my contacts in. I can't do those things. But I can put together this card, you guys, because we have punches. I can punch with one hand. Um, this is also a punch. So you'll want to check out my blog. In fact, let's just go over there really quick. Hang on a minute. Oh, that is so cute. Make sure cute. I'm in the right spot on my I have computer. to start playing with this because, um, my you know, my husband's in assisted living, and so I make treats and stuff yeah. for all the holidays. Yeah. So I have to make tons of them. So, yeah, I got to start playing with this sweet. So yeah, I can this start is a really cute sweet. And you can make it real detailed if you want to. Um, I'm sorry, my arm is in the way again. Let me tap with this one and see if I can do it here. There we go. Um, so let me just show you where that blog post is, by the way. I'm going to scroll up. Uh, see, it's the last one. So we're going to click on them bones. And there it is. Oh, and there's my different, uh, you know, situations <laughs> with my hand. But all the details are in there. And this is glow in the dark. Paper. That's right. Oh, my God, I forgot about that. Yeah, in the U.S. market right now, it's not available, but it will be. Um, but in the meantime, you could just stamp and cut out like a uh, yellow or orange or, gosh, right or a white circle or whatever. But Oh, my gosh, so yeah. cute. And this is a little wobbler, so you can get wobbles or whatever they're called um, in Am at Amazon. And if you go to my favorite... Oh, I'm not even showing you guys. I'm sorry. Let me, um, let's go to this shop, my favorite extras, sorry, this is, I was at the blog post and then I go back down to the desktop. 
So if you go to my favorite extras, you're going to see, and I have a link to it, but this is where you can find things like the wobbles. And today we're going to be using um, post-it tape and my precision tip glue bottle. So I just wanted to share those things with you. But let's go back to the desktop. Sorry, again, my hand is in the way because I'm using my left. Um, <laughs> these are the wobbles, and that's what I did for this little guy. He's just done so like a... So cute. Yeah. So, okay. I like so, that. It's easy, too. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. Yeah, and it was. It really was. So let's bring in that paper, just the paper. This is going to be one of the prizes um, for today. Again, sorry, I have to get used to... Paper. There we go. So the um, something floral. Delightful. Delightful. And Del it is delightful. <laughs> it is. It is. And we'll throw a few wobbles in there. And then there's also some other things. So for the prize winners today, uh, for commenting, if you want to just set that back over there, that's great. Um, that's what we're going to be giving out. That plus some embellishments. So keep that in mind. And now, hopefully you'll comment if you haven't yet. Say hello. Tell us about the weather. Tell us where you're from. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. <laughs> All right, so today I'm going to bring back these guys, which were used on my last card, my Halloween card. These are the Adhesive Back Sparkle Gems, and we're going to have um, this paper, and there's some other specialty paper under there. So this is the paper that's from the suite. It is the, and let's see if I can, no, I can't do it with my right hand, so I'm just going to go to pinch outwards. There we go. So this is the Let's Go Sh or the Lay Shop paper, and if you want to just breeze through those so we can see them all. All right, so <laughs> we have that's some. That's so cute. What these? Yeah, and that's buildings. the one that we're going to use on the card today. Nice. And you can see there's nice, good size little shops and, and storefronts on the, the paper. And I the colors on this page. I just oh, nice and earthy. Yeah. So oh, there's your clothes shop. Yes. <laughs> I love it. Um, so all of these could definitely be used to make this type of a card today. It's, um, again, it's a simple little diorama card. Um, but we'll be using the same one that I used on my original. Little tiny stores. Wow, those are teenies. Nice. And then some close-ups on the next two sheets of food and books. And then we'll share the flip side. And the flip side are more like patterns and stuff. So, hi like Florence, how, happy Wednesday to you too. <laughs> I like how they do that, you know, so that you can, if you don't particularly, if you like say you love these colors, but you don't particularly want this, I love how you, they always put it background usually. Yes, so if you flip it over, side. yeah, and there we have that. So we'll be using um, none of those sides today, but you can see some really nice, simpler patterns that are just for great for everything. Oh, that's kind of cool, too. <laughs> Cindy like says, three hands make, make uh, <laughs> to make cards. Yes, three hands. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Sally. Oh, my gosh, 5 a.m. there in New Zealand. Oh, wow. <laughs> that's dedication. Yes. <laughs> all yeah, right. So those are all pretty cool. Nice patterns. Yes, they are. And then this is the soft shimmer paper, and it comes in five different colors. A um, couple pinks, a couple greenish blue. Well, this is Lost Lagoon, which I think of as a blue, but it's also greenish. So, yeah, I think of it as is a, is a, is a blue, really? Well, Lost Lagoon, it can be both. It's greenish yeah, blue. Yeah, I bet you if you put it next to one of our other blues, it would look more blue. Yeah, but it really goes yeah, well with Pretty Peacock, which is oh, this one. I love those And I always think of that as... <laughs> green. I don't know why. Anyways, we're going to be using the navy and I will just have, um, um, we're going to have Terry go ahead and start cutting now. If you can cut a strip of that knight of navy that is 12 inches long by 3 eighths inches Oh my wide. god, Rachel, does it have to be an eighth? <laughs> it's like... I'm just going to move some things out of the way while she cuts a 3 eighths inch wide strip. <laughs> so, is that like almost a quarter? Well, there's, uh, these are the eighths, right? Yeah, so when you come two, in. three. I just want to go to here. That's the one right there. Yeah. Nope, a oh. little further over. You were at the half in, or the quarter. So you want to go, yep, to that one. You got it. Crazy. Yep. 
all the way down. <laughs> Sweet. I can do it. All right. And then you we're going to cut it in this direction. Days, I'm telling you. <laughs> we're going to cut it in that direction. I'm going to zoom in just a bit here. Um, at four and a quarter. I better make sure that I... Yeah, four and a quarter. Whoops. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? And you know what I forgot to do? I forgot to share the little supply list. Um, four and a quarter and another one at four and a quarter. I'm going to my supply list here. That's why I'm on my computer, guys. <laughs> Hang on. Keep going. Uh, we'll just push that out of the way. There it is. And then the last one is going to be at huh, three and three eighths. <laughs> Girl. Let's so see. This is, one, these little guys are 16. So if you yeah, go. Yeah, one, two, three. Okay. Yep. Yep. And you'd think I'd never <laughs> cut paper before, you guys. Oh, my God. It's just that, yeah. I know. When, I, when I'm, like, at home, I'm like, okay, one, <laughs> two, three. Okay. Yeah. And that left one-eighth of an I inch know. <laughs> that we're not using. So we're using all three of these Save strips. Save scraps for each. Yes. Oh, that one? <laughs> yeah. No. I you, say Well, I suppose it would be good in, like, a shaker like, card or something. Yeah. You don't save that size, do you? <laughs> well, look, you could take it and put, like, okay, so just, I'm just saying, look at that. You can oh add my God. a little something, something, right? Okay, fine. It's sparkly <laughs> and all that kind of stuff. So, yeah, so I So you don't have any them. filled garbages at your house? <laughs> okay. You're so funny. I cut them down so that they actually, you know, look decent, oh. you know, and I store well. So, yeah. I love Terry. She has to come over to more of my lives, right, you guys? Okay, this is the um, little sheet that talks about the measurements and supply lists for, that we're going to need for this card. Now you can see the finished card front and back and see how, why it's a diorama. Like, so cute. Yeah, see that fun little, it like stands up too, just like the other cards. Yeah. Um, but the only thing missing on that list, and I really like, I thought I was doing well, it's a the ink pad. We need ink for stamping the sentiment oh, on the back. And, and this. Yes. I did add that. Oh, I did. Sweet. I did. I added it like an hour ago, and then I forgot about the Navy, uh. Night of Navy ink. So <laughs> there will be some revision, but this blog post doesn't go live until 4 p.m. And at that point, you can download this PDF that you see on my computer screen here. So you'll be able to take and print that off and come back to it at a later time. <gasps> they love your jewelry. I know, she's got beautiful jewelry on her hands, doesn't Thank she? Thank you. Okay, let's go back to the desktop now. And I'm going to get this off the screen. Oh, you know what? I'm going to leave it there because we're going to need it for us. We're going to need some cutting measurements again because I'm going to have you do some of this. In fact, let's turn it in the horizontal direction. Okay. We're going to bring it to the five and a half inch mark. I can do that. Okay. <laughs> Are we going all the way? Yep. Oh, okay. And oh, you card can make, base? Yeah. <laughs> yes. And you can make two. Like, right. Card base. These make card bases. <laughs> Five and a half by, you know, cut this way it would be a, a card. Or if we do it the other way, it could be a card too, right? Mm -hmm. But so, but we're going to cut it this way instead of the long way because we have to actually cut this in half. But before we do that, we're going to score it in four places. Sally. So we're going to bring it to the half inch mark. And we're going to go from this direction. Oh, this direction. Yep. So you're going to bring it to the half inch mark. Okay. And score it. All the way down? Yep. And then we're going to score it at one inch. And we're going to do the same thing to the other side. So you're going to flip it around and score at half inch and one inch. She's doing great. <laughs> Half inch measures, yay! Gail. I can do those. Yeah. <laughs> and Gail says, "Woohoo!" I know. So people that watch me often know that I even go to the sixteenth inch mark. But I love math. I love. I math. know. I, I I was in dummy math. They never let me go past that. So what's that say? <laughs> right. I forgot. Trisha's helping out Ginny here. I forgot to introduce two other special people. They're not with us here, but they're with us on the live. Trisha Josephs and Lisa Marshall. Trisha Josephs is on YouTube and Lisa Marshall's on Facebook. They're there to answer questions for you. So sorry, I forgot to introduce my moderators. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. <laughs> and did I even say the date? It's October 4th today. Okay, here we go. Can't Next one. <laughs> We're going to cut that in half at four and a quarter inches. 
And now I'm going to look Whoa, on my notes day. while she's doing that to make sure. Okay, we did all of oh, that. Oh, wait, Good. wait, wait. The blade came out. There we go. <laughs> all, all right. Good. So now we have two pieces that are exactly the same, but one of them we're going to cut special. Okay, we're going to cut a window out of it because we want to be able to see scenery on the inside. We're doing half measures, <laughs> okay. like half inch type of measures. <laughs> so this little window is going to be cut so that it's a half of an inch from the inside border and the top and bottom edges. So here are the half inch um, borders here on the inside. Those little, mm -hmm. in fact here we'll just bend it so you can see those. So the window is going to go a half of an inch in from all of those four sides, okay? <laughs> I even point with my left hand now, you guys. I'm getting good. <laughs> so you're going to bring it to the one and a half inch mark, which is basically right the where the here. white and the gray meet. Yep. And, and you're going to gonna start go. it. And oh, and I have to share this. So I'm going to just stick this little white under here. Go ahead and put it down. I'm going to show you this little tip because some of you like to actually take and put white paper Oops. under this area. Smart Yeah, idea. but the problem is, is if you do a lot of 16th inch and eighth inch measuring like I do, this sometimes gets in the way if you have white paper underneath here. So some of you will say to me, Rachel, why don't you stick a piece of white paper under there? That is the reason why I don't do that, but you can always just, you know, temporarily insert a piece here so you know where to go. So we're gonna start a half of an inch from the top and we're going to press down and we're going to go a half of an inch to the bottom, which is going to bring you to three and three quarter inches. Wait a minute. three and three. <laughs> All right. <laughs> we got her. Yes. And you know what? Since it's going to be the same on the other side, flip it around and do the same side now instead of like doing the, yeah. Do that that do that opposite Sweet. side again. Cause that'll be easier oh, than trying end, to memorize right? what you did. Yeah, just stick it right to that spot. And then, and then I'll just slide. Technically this I should still be at three and three quarters. Yes, you should be. Yes. We'll check her out, but I think I am. <laughs> We're both going off camera as we do this. Oh, are we? <laughs> no, that's okay. The paper's not. <laughs> Oh wait, and, I'm and you go have to such where? pretty hair. It's inside the screen right now. <laughs> gonna, oh my gosh. You're gonna go all the way up to the half inch mark. You got to you know, the back old, a little bit the so old. they can see. There we go. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I'm blind. She has you a guys. beautiful head of hair I'm, though, so this I'm is why old, it doesn't matter. <laughs> so I always take my glasses off when I'm doing something really you know close. So <laughs> That's Oh, the tear and tape on the adhesive. Yes, you could do that too. Okay, so now we're going to go to the half inch mark. You can see, yep, you did it right. To the half inch mark. And you're gonna set it down. And this time, if you want to, you can just use your cuts as guides. Because your cuts are there, you're gonna do oh. your starting and your stopping point at those two spots. I'm gonna grab something. And you gotta get your head out of the way. There That's you go. My head out of the way. <laughs> <laughs> but you guys. Ah. <laughs> And then, yep, and it's oh, okay no, if you go over a little. Oh, I got a little cross. No, it's totally fine. Half more. Because that half means more. it's handmade. That's, well, right? you know, you know. <laughs> But, seriously, it's the glare on this. There we go. All right. Shazam! Shazam! Is this, <laughs> is this the hardest part? <laughs> it is. It totally is. Well, for you. For me, <laughs> it's cutting. So I did oh. pre-cut a piece that will go inside of our scene. Cool. But I'm going to demonstrate it anyways, just because I want to show you my skill is improving, you guys. So oh, you're actually going to cut, cut. I'm actually going to cut one. I'm going to show you what I did yesterday because I cut this out and I, I can't use this finger, right? So I took and I cut using my other fingers and I could do it. I was so proud of myself. So yeah, um, let's see if I can do it again here. I'm gonna get a little more, fingers. a little more detailed. I don't so, want to take you to the hospital today. Yeah, <laughs> I did it. See, I can do it, you guys. So if I can stamp with one hand injured, anybody can stamp, right? Yes. Yes. <laughs> All right, so anyways, we cut this out, and we also got from that sheet of paper, 
one of these little guys. This is like a little menu, um, you know, little street stand. A street whatever. stand. What do you call it? I them? love that sidewalk, name. Sidewalk stand. Yeah. Or I don't know. Yeah, a street stand, a street sign, uh, yeah. uh, menu sign, whatever. We've got that, and we've got this one, but we didn't cut that out. You know why? Because we don't have to. We don't have to. <laughs> Guess what we have? <laughs> we have dies. That's right. That's right. <laughs> Nice. So, you ready to do some die cutting? Uh-huh. Okay, so we'll set these pieces aside. You don't need this piece, by the way. Um, it Keep is it. extra, but don't throw it away because it is a good size scrap. Yeah, 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 it's good. I'm going to throw this one away, though. Don't tell Terry. <laughs> okay, did she hear me? <laughs> All right, so we have, we have some white scraps, granny apple green, crumb cake, and that. The one that's in your hand nice. and we're going to bring the machine in which actually is oh wait one more that one nice 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 i don't even know why I, oh i have these i'm like why do i have these on my table oh yeah those we were going to show them i think that was part of the suite yeah i'm not using them but you could okay they're cute so we have our papers Sparkly. and we're going to shove these down here because what we want to do next is we're going to take this big machine and if you can bring it up i have it yeah, I'll take those not guys off. Touching it, dear. <laughs> and we actually, if you can angle it, then they can see. Oh, okay. There we go. Oh, so perfect. we're gonna lay down some pieces and we're gonna use some post-it tape to at least hold a few of them in place. Um, or she is. <laughs> yeah. 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 <laughs> and I'm gonna make sure that we have all our pieces over here ready to go. Um, while she is doing that, I'm also going to mention that we need a couple of white sheets of cardstock, and those measurements are th um, three and three eighths in this direction, and four and an eighth in this direction. Okay, so those are also ready. We've got our Knight of Navy, the Knight of Navy soft shimmer paper, and then the basic white cardstock. So cute. <laughs> Yeah, and some of these she does not have to put any post-it tape on because it's okay if they shift a little bit while we're getting the um, cutting the cutting mat on top and uh, cranking Did them we through. do the bench in what color? The bench the, is in that in color, one? the pecan oh, pie. Yeah. So we're using granny apple green for the foliage, pecan pie for the bench, um, crumb cake for the um, lamp post. That looks good. And then we're going to do the lamp post one more time in white afterwards. So that's not going to fit. <laughs> <laughs> we got You'll a different why. script. Okay. Yeah, we got, we're only using yeah. half of it. <laughs> we're only using part oh, of it. Oh, yeah. gotcha, 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 gotcha. <laughs> that's not going to fit. <laughs> you should do videos with me more often. You're fun. Okay. <laughs> I knew she was fun, which is why we invited her. I think her. it's kind of mentally no. challenged is the word. So we'll need to keep the machine oh, yeah, here, right. but you know what? I'll bring it over here with my left hand because I can lift with my left hand. Ah, okay. That's the thing I couldn't do before surgery, you guys. This little guy over the top here kept shifting to the side when I was trying to lift heavy ah, stuff. And it snaps. I, yes. Did it snap? I hit Yeah. That. I had something with my wrist one time, and it it. it for like six months, it was snapping, and I'm like, what is going on? It didn't hurt, but it would just snap. And I went to coffee with someone. I did a make and take at a coffee shop, and one of the ladies was a therapist, physical therapist, and she goes, let me see that. She goes, what's it doing? And she massaged my arm for oh. like 20 minutes, and it never happened again. <laughs> nice. It was so bizarre. See? Yeah, so massage is healthy. If yeah, you don't yeah. get massages or you don't have one of those massage little machine thingies or, you know, just do it once in a while to your, you know, rub your arms, rub your back, rub, you know, rub your legs, rub your feet. <laughs> no, I can't do rub that. Rub your fingers. I'm so ticklish. I had a massage one time massage and the lady, skull. she was doing my feet and she stopped at one of them and she goes, uh, all right, what's going on? And Because like, you were so ticklish? I was physically like in the pillow going, I'm going to freak out any second, though. And oh, wow. she goes, you're too Then you close. do it to yourself, right? Do you rub your hands and feet and stuff? I, yeah, if I'm okay. doing it, that's fine. Okay. But someone else, it's like, because when I was a kid, they used to, you know, pin me down, and then they would tickle my feet. And oh, so now that's not nice. I'm like, okay. So she's like, we're done with this part. We have to redo the whole thing if we're going to do your other foot. And I'm like, yeah. 
We're so not going to do that. bring your hand over here while Sorry. you're doing that, by the way. Yeah, Outside. so what she's doing right now, and she's doing like little surgical movements to the... <laughs> <laughs> to the greenery. We're having surgery. Yeah, she's post. <laughs> she's picking out with the take your pick tool the little, the um, little chads or whatever. The, little pieces. The extras that we don't need. And let's see. And there's the cute little sign. So cute. So cute. It's it's much easier to make cards Whoops. than it is to do my hair, you guys. I was struggling this morning, so I stuck the topper on again. <laughs> I love it. Oh, thanks, Beth. She goes thumbs up, please. Thumbs up. That would be great. I appreciate it. <laughs> <laughs> I have a topper too because my hair is just fine and does nothing so it's nice to put on I a topper just to myself. make you, yeah make yourself feel a little more luxurious yeah, yeah. and dressed up once in a while I don't use it very often but I love having it when I do and I love that nowadays extra hair and hair pieces are more socially acceptable than they used to be like mm -hmm. wear it you guys like a hat just have fun 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 there are those pieces. Now we have one more piece to die cut, and that is the white paper. Um, so I'll shove this out of the way. We'll bring this back in. These are pieces. And uh, you see this little guy that you poked out of the... You don't uh, have to save that. No, but we're doing it on the white one. This is the one we want on the white cardstock. Oh, yeah, it's a glass. So sh we were making jokes about tiny pieces. This is the one you're going to want for the white. You could do it also in like a yellow, like Daffodil Delight or Lemon Lolly. Um, but basically what it does is it creates the look of the lamp post being lit up or at least, <gasps> yeah. It's at glow in the dark. Oh, you could do glow in the dark. <laughs> what? I like that idea. Oh, gosh. Well, now we're going to throw okay. in a sheet of glow-in-the-dark paper for each of the winners, too. <laughs> so <laughs> the winners are going to get um, some wobbler, wobble, wobbles, some wobbles, the wobble, wobble, uh, <laughs> wobble. wobble. <laughs> no, let's gobble, from? gobble. What's that from? Gobble, gobble? It's like yeah, an old I don't commercial. Think there's anything that says <laughs> gobble, gobble, gobble. There's some commercial back a long time ago. <laughs> gobble, gobble. What's gobble. that? You know what I'm talking about, because you're having that same look on your face. Okay, anyways. I just thought it was a turkey. <laughs> <laughs> it could be. Maybe it's not right? I don't know. Oh, gosh. I don't uh, know. Yeah. My <laughs> mind goes in weird places. It's just, I can't help it. It's just a weird little thing. So we're die cutting just the top of it, because we just need that little light piece. And then I'll take your scraps out of the way here. Way. We don't need this anymore, right? We don't. You can set that on that table or stool behind me. Mm -hmm. And I'll clean up the messes. And we'll bring all these fun little pieces in because we're now going to assemble the car. Oh, we got a stamp. We got a stamp, too. Oh, oh, oh. So basically. So there it is. Yay! <laughs> and there's my scratchy mat. <laughs> I know. Yeah, but that's got lots of love. In I it. forgot to bring the nice, clean ones that I usually use in my videos. I Sorry, you guys. Get to see right. my scratchy ones. But they do last a long time. They do. So. They do, they do. There we go. We'll put that on the gray so you can see it better. But there, there's a piece that you definitely don't want to throw away. All yep. right. Are we ready? Yeah. Let's do some stamping. What are we doing? Okay. And I'm going to let you open that because it's easier for two-handed people to open ink pads. There we go. Um, the, the stamps that we're using on this are going to be these little visual... Um, bakery pieces okay. and the happy birthday and you're such a sweet treat so I thought we'd stamp the bakery one in the middle so there's that I'm a I'm a I'm a stamp I'm a this is, oh she flips it upside down to do I it I can't talk but that's this is how I do them because I just I don't know. no that's fine everybody has their style and we're doing this in the <laughs> Here, I'm going to move this out of the way so you don't put your finger. Yeah. So you don't put your <laughs> fingers in it. <laughs> I can take care of it there. There we go. Mm. We're good. Okay, what are we non doing? Non-toxic, yum. Mm. Um, you're going to stamp in it down middle? in the middle. Yep. Perfect. Wow. And then you're going to stamp this one above and this one below. <laughs> nice. I can do this. I have a blue finger now. <sighs> Rachel. Here, let's use some. Can you Can you spray that on me? <laughs> you get the big size. There we go. Thank you. Right. It's the stamp and mess cleaner. We're gonna attempt to get some of this off. Oh, yeah. Can I that. have a piece of your little Kleenex? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't want to be doing the whole. Oh, she gets. Oh, oh. <laughs> it's okay. Are you okay? Yep. It was this finger. Uh, we bumped. 
<laughs> I was like, oh my god. No, we just bumped that finger there. It's fine. All right, I'm gonna go against my little thing. We're gonna do such. A, how far above? Anywhere? Oh, you gotta put your head back. Oh, sorry. <laughs> so I would say a little further down. Down. Okay. A little fur- there you go. Like that. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I'm looking in my reflection thing up here, my little screen. Ah, I don't like how that stands. Oh, should we flip it over? There are two sides to the paper. And if we put it against the navy, flip it over. There so we you go. don't see it. So you might as well do it one more time. Okay. Okay, she's going to do it one more time. Can't get good help. Don't yeah. <laughs> no, you're very good help. But I have a blue finger. <laughs> <laughs> well, it'll match your other hand. Oh, God. I almost okay, did you sideways. see what she was doing? She was looking at the sides of the block for lining it up because... That's what we sometimes do if we put, go ahead and stamp. That's what we sometimes do if we put our stamps on our blocks so that they're lined up with the edges. We look at the edges of the block, and if they're, if they're slightly off, then anyways, put your stamps on tilted so that you're always looking at your image. That's what I think helps. Mm-hmm. I don't know. <laughs> sure, Rachel. She's, like, Rach. she's <laughs> like, Rachel, I always put them on straight. <laughs> That's better. Yeah. It's still it's still kind of, oops, wrong one. I think it's the first time I use the stamp, too. Sometimes they have that extra little coating on them, and if you rub them against your Oh, you know what? Yeah, you do, you do it on yeah. your arms and stuff. The oils yeah. from your skin kind of. Yeah, because there's like just this little, it's like a manufacturer kind of coating. Yeah. If you ink up the stamp, stamp it down, ink it up, stamp it, ink it, stamp it on scrap paper, and then you use it on your project, you get a better result. So go ahead and stamp that on my it? scrap paper. Do that a couple of times on the scrap paper, like ink and ink and stamp, because I don't think I've used these yet, so they still have kind of that manufacture. Oh, see, it's looking better as we go. Now do it. My fault. I didn't prepare the stamps before. <laughs> it's all good. So do I do this close or yeah? Farther? I would say just as close as the other one. You are such a sweet tweet. What, what, sweet, what? sweet tweet. <laughs> <laughs> Happy birthday! You're such a sweet tweet. That's so cute. Treat. Except it now, has an R in I it. don't like that because that's is that going to be hard? Oh, then you go like this, and I can do that. I know. You know what? I you, do you remember back in the day, a hundred years ago when I started stamping? They sold these little square blocks that had sand, fine sandpaper on them. Yeah. I still have mine, and I use it all the time because for things like if I don't like the crisp edge, I will do that sandpaper across and it'll, yeah. it'll like make it look yeah. good. Yeah, that That's works, because, especially if you don't like to have a fingernail edge. Right? I, I closed it. I closed it, you guys. Woo-hoo! I'm so proud of myself. All right. Is it your birthday coming up? Um, It was. When? August 7th. <gasps> That's okay. That's why we get along. We're Leos. Okay. I know. So, <laughs> so we're going to go ahead and put this one on the back side actually let's do this let's start bending these puppies okay so yeah get them ready do you want me to score yeah so now we're gonna bring the bone folder which i can't use i can't use the bone folder yet oh. i miss it it's one of my favorite tools and it, it actually is. goes the other way if you want to oh. score it the other way <laughs> yep that's okay <laughs> i was wondering at first with that yeah she would have said something yeah there you go like a stair step or a fan fold or whatever. We are having fun, Carol. <laughs> oh, wait. Is that right? Yeah. Yep. Yep. You got it right. I swear. So this is the inside and this is the outside. So we're going to stick this piece on the outside. All right. And watch. I can do this. Watch, watch, watch. Okay. I'm so proud of myself. I can do seal left-handed. Okay. Hang on. It's a new roll. Is it sticky yet? Oh, yep. it's sticky. Okay. Now it's on my hands. Everything's getting on my finger today. <laughs> so, look at you guys. Woo-hoo! I'm so talented. I can do seal with my left hand. Ta da! <laughs> so, that's going to go on the back side. You know it's the back side because it pops out at you. Okay. Oh, and you can flatten it down to stick it on. It might be easier. But you've got those those creases. Now, emphasized. is there a border? 
There is. So you just look between all of those little folds and the You guys are <laughs> you blind. blind. I know, I know. It's like I can't see unless I take my glasses off. This is this is called getting old. Oh. Do you it's want so sad. to take your glasses off? You can. You don't <laughs> I have my readers, like I put them on every once in a while when I really have to look up something really close because I wear contacts for distance, but now they're multifocal so I can see close and far. It's, it is fun getting old, isn't it? Oh my God. This one goes on the inside. <laughs> this way? Yeah. Whoop, whoop. All righty. And that's going to be what we um, make our little inside scene on. So, oh no. silly me. What happened? Oh, we forgot to cut one more. It's fine. We'll just do one on the inside of this card. It'll be slight. It'll be slightly unfinished. Oh, well, that's how uh, we roll. What did I do? <laughs> <laughs> There's no mistakes in stamping. That's <clears throat> why I stamp. Because you know what? Oh shoot! Wait a Is minute. Is it not in there? <laughs> it's like, okay. Wait, wait. wait you know wait. what? There we go. Because I am using a little bit of my hands, I could have you do one more of these little guys over here, and sure. I could try to put this stuff on. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and take my seal adhesive again, and I'm going to put the seal on the back side of the building. So here we have our little bakery shop. She's die cutting one more for us. This one? Yeah. Um, uh, the one that curves in like that. Yeah, this one. that's the one. Okay, seal. Look at, I can do this. I can put the seal on. I'm so proud of myself. Oh, and if you put the seal right up to the edge, by the way, then you can't tuck. There we go. And we need to tuck a little bit. Uh, I'm going to turn it this way because we need to catch it on the... <laughs> what do you mean you can't tuck? What do you well, mean? okay, so we need to tuck some foliage behind this side. And behind this side. So if we have our adhesive all the way to the edge, we won't be able to tuck these little guys in and under. Okay? I so I don't, yeah, I have some edge on each side. So this is going to go, and make sure your words are in the right direction. This is going to go in here centered. Yes, centered. Because we want us to, we want to see it in the window. Okay? So we're going to put that down centered. And I'm not going to stick it down real hard because, again, we want to put our foliage in there. Foliage. Yay! So we have three of them. So one is going to go, and I'm just peeking here. Yep. One is going to go on this side underneath, and one is going to go on this side underneath. So to do that, we're going to bring in the precision tip bottle, because I found that this here was my friend with adhesive. So we will just put um, that adhesive on the back side of these guys. All the, just the bottom yeah um, okay. yeah although you can put it like a couple dots here and there and we're just gonna tuck it underneath the is this gonna like explode out it shouldn't <laughs> <laughs> it's my fine it's my precision tip bottle is this in the way okay. yeah so this is the glue that we're using it's a multi-purpose liquid glue and I just add it to the precision tip bottles because I find that it's easier to um, get oh wait you got it I don't know I haven't like filled it's... it in a while because I can't, but... Oh, here it comes. Yay. Okay. So it brings out just a tiny little bit instead of flowing really fast. I'm going to grab this Take Your Although Pick tool from you, by the way. it's going to um, explode, though I can tell. It won't explode. I promise you. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, it's going to explode. I know it is. So I'm just going to lift that up a little bit because that's where we're going to tuck. We're going to tuck that foliage under there. And I should have put it under there as I was adding the house, but I don't have two hands. <laughs> Hi, Rachel. It's 3.45 a.m. in Australia. Oh, oh you couldn't sleep, so you woke up and watched me? Oh, nice. thank you. So let's, stuck, let's stick that under here. In fact, we might have to peel this back up because I think Rachel put adhesive on there way too close. So we want to have it kind of tucked under as if it's just kind of a little plant coming the out the oh, back okay. of the building. Alrighty. <laughs> Line it up. Okay. Yep, 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 yep. How about that? Like that? Perfect. And then the other one goes on the other side. 
in front or in back? Or in back? Um, is that this one? Maybe it's this one. Oh, these oh, are yeah, both the yeah, same. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're both the same. Uh -oh. Either one. Did we put the wrong one in? No, it's good. Oh, they, okay. Oh, is my building tilted? Holy crud, Rachel. Yes. <laughs> So I can't stand it. Oh, well, we might as well leave it up then. And I'll <laughs> yeah, just stick we'll this. leave it up. Oh, my foliage is coming off. <laughs> Girl, <laughs> you're a mad mess. <laughs> oh, dear, oh, dear. It's funny coming from me. <laughs> <laughs> what, the mad mess comment? Yes. <laughs> Talk about mad mess. Is oh, thanks, bling bling. <laughs> <laughs> she goes, she's enjoying, she's enjoying this live. I think it's because we're both, you know, getting goofy. goofy. Yeah. And we haven't had any alcohol. No. So. <laughs> she literally just came in the door about 15 minutes before the live. Right. <laughs> it's like, I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm coming. coming. <laughs> okay. Then the bench gets added. We're going to add the bench. Gotta have a bench. Look at the bottom of the bench. Why does it have a wiggly little thing on the bottom? Oh. oh, it's better. Okay. Yay. You just All right. got to kind of tweak it a little bit. There. So Ooh, I used to play perfect. with paper dolls and Barbie dolls. I love anything miniature. So this suite, when I saw it in the catalog, was totally up my alley. Oh, and yeah, I... we're just adding that flat, too. Yep. All of this is flat. No dimensionals are being used in this card. That's different. <laughs> <laughs> Angie goes, you're a mad mess. <laughs> <laughs> Not as organized as I usually am with my two hands, am I? It's fine. We're doing great. We're having fun. Yes. Because exactly. that is what paper crafting should be, is fun. Exactly. So I just added that so that you can kind of see the little treats, but kind of not. Yeah. Mm, about there. Mm. Wherever. <laughs> Oops. Oop, 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 oop. Wherever. How about that? That looks good. Yep. Because if you put it on top, like, so it's lined up, then you don't have yeah, that dimension. you don't have that, right? You need to have it sitting out further. True. Yeah, that's perfect. So now we add the top, the top of the card. So we're going to score and score, or fold and fold on the score lines. And while you do that, I'm going to trim up this little tree with my four and fingers. And the opposite, right? I'm going to still do the same. Yes. That I did. Okay. So I'm going to cut off the bottom. Right about here, because you don't have to have your foliage like all the stuff. <laughs> oh, I did it. I did it. It doesn't have to look like it is when it's cut out. So now we have two little plants. We have a short oh, one and we have a tall one. Cool. And the tall one gets wrapped around this guy. You could put him up there. It could. Do you want to cut another one out? Because this guy has to wrap around this guy. Like, I just have to have that, like that, on the front. Oh, cute. I think that, oh, we have to zoom in, too, because now we're getting into real miniatures here. Hang on. There. So that plant gets wrapped around the menu, and we're going to add that to the front of this so we can flatten this guy out now that we've got the score lines in there. Uh, so I only want to tape like at the bottom right um right because so I don't if want we look this. at the finished card here we don't want to have any adhesive on this side of the sign okay so i have a black and blue hand here and now i have a blue finger oh, this is fun <laughs> i'm telling you it's <laughs> your your color coordinating <laughs> i'm matching with the navy card that's right oh yeah <laughs> for sure Maybe, maybe. So we just want, yes, I adhesive on the corner, the bottom and on the sides. Oh, wait, and then we're going to stick that foliage under there, too. I think I'm going to. So she, she's working on it. <laughs> the foliage can have glue all over the back. It oh. doesn't matter. Like, because that piece does not go off the Oh, it doesn't go off. Oh, okay. <clears throat> <laughs> I make noises. <laughs> Choo choo choo. <laughs> they used to they used to call me Tourette's because whenever I was at work and stuff. Oh really? You would just I would make just noises. start making noises. It's mm. just like and they're like, what are you doing? It's like I don't know. I just I've always done it. Someone mentioned color forms. So color forms oh, are yeah. also miniature ish. Like paper dolls. Paper yeah. dolls only they stick, right? I loved color forms too. So totally agree with you guys. Okay. 
Oh, wait, I got to put this little sign in here, too. Yeah, so as you add the sign, you just kind of wrap that little guy around there. Can you do it? Uh -huh, I picked it up by the wrong way. You know, do you need a third hand? Wait, wait, wait. No, no, no. We got it. Okay. We got it. We got it. And this guy wants yes. this like this. Yes. All right. Okay. Wait. Move over. Oh, yeah. I can go down. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I talked to myself. <laughs> it looks this. great. You're doing great. This is beautiful. <laughs> Yay. Okay, and then we got to add the lamp post, the uh, oh yeah, the whiteness inside the lamp post because oh it's, that's where he goes. Yeah, and then he just sits at the bottom of the lamp post. Nice. Yay! And then after that, we just have the embellishing, which is the soft shimmer paper and the uh, adhesive back sparkle gems. So. So while she's doing that, I'm just going to show you that this. Did, did, did you see? You saw the picture that I shared on my blog. This was the the um, second little contraption that I had that I put around my hands, and it was longer. And they cut it down yesterday. So yesterday was the first night I slept without protection on my wrist, and I was like a little worried about it because everything like relates. Oh, I wow. know. <laughs> so, like, oh my gosh. So yeah, I slept with this and that guy on. I only, again, have the bandage on here because um, I didn't want you guys to see the grossness of my incision. Um, it's not I, that gross. <laughs> it looked like a centipede, though, with the stitches in it. Oh, it's I know. So That's weird. creepy. Yeah. Um, but yeah, this is the little guy <laughs> that goes... Creepy. <laughs> it is creepy. <laughs> it's Halloween creepy. Yeah. <laughs> so this is molded to my fingers. It was really fun to see how they made it because this guy has to stay out extended i mean i can bend it a little bit but like not too much so so i'm constantly flipping people off <laughs> i know i said you're so rude i'm like, so rude can't take you anywhere so now we have the front and the back and can you imagine with that the other um, buildings on the paper like all the different scenes oh, you could make it's so cute you could just do scenes you wouldn't even have to make these and into cards they could be things that you just prop on like a mantle or whatever and you'd have mm -hmm. like this fun little city. You could make a little village. You could totally. You could totally make a little village. So now we connect them together, and guess where we connect them? Like right here. Yeah. And ooh, right ooh, there. Ooh. So just those two spots, and you can choose to use the um, multi-purpose liquid glue or the seal, what it, whatever adhesive of your choice, and um, and then we just to have the top. The embellishment. So, oh, and we got to stick that little guy in there, too. And, oh, I want to show you this tip. Oh. So you see the take your pick tool? It has this little gummy end on it. I love that thing. You can grab this like you do with embellishments, and you can take and put the glue inside the Do you want to do light. this? Or can you Well, we have to get the glue this? on there first. I could. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't have glue on the back yet. <laughs> so yeah, stick that in there and then I can do that. Yes, I will add the light. And it's not really light. It's more like just whitening it up so it looks like a, a window. That's or like glass, you know what I mean? Absolutely. Yeah. So there. Cuteness. Cute. Okay. Okay. So to do, do we have to add anything else in no, here? No, oh, oh. just the embellishment. But oh, I like okay. adding my embellishments at the end. Me too. So she's going to connect the two pe two ends there. <laughs> Maybe. And wait, wait, if wait. you can line those up, then the other part is pretty easy because then you just flatten the whole thing down. So Terry is my sister demonstrator. Yes, sorry. <laughs> For those of you that came in late, she's a sister demonstrator. We both signed up under the same person, Susan Campfield, um, years back. Yeah. Yeah. We had, we were roommates once at a convention. Yes. <laughs> that was fun. It was Rory's 20 theme. We yeah. had a blast. We were dressed up in like Roaring 20s attire and we we took and did a, a horse ride. That what was those, one of our favorite memories. Yeah. What are those bike? It was a bike ride. Oh, it was a bike the ride. Bi the bike. Oh, it was a bike ride. Right. Little... right. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, it was fun. But we were like in this little carriage and yeah. we looked, I don't it was know. so cute. Yeah, and see how she puffed it up just now? So you take and you can puff it up to stand it, or you can flatten it down, and it fits into an envelopes. Envelope. Let me grab an envelope here. Here is an envelope, so you can demonstrate sticking it in the envelope. 
There oh, we and go. we gotta embellish it too. But just go ahead and slide it in there so they can see. See, it's a card that actually can be nice. mailed. And it doesn't have any dimensionals. It has a little bit of embellishing, but that's it. Like we're gonna put one of these little guys on there, and it's a tiny little one. So and he's it should... the little doorknob, right? Yeah, he's the doorknob. Just because I thought it'd be fun to put a doorknob on oh, it. Oh, for sure. Because there's really no doorknob have on it. A little it. bling, just a little bling. You know what I mean? Yeah, it exactly. And I think that's why I wanted to use it because it was bling. <laughs> and here's even more bling. We're gonna put the sparkles on. Oh, I forgot about that. <laughs> yeah. So we have two longer strips on the sides, and then the shortest one is along the back. And I, I was if it doesn't fit, second. it doesn't fit. I thought I, I thought I cut it wrong. So oh, yeah, oh, no, no. Oh, no. No, because, and if you did, it was because I directed you wrong. Oh, what do you need? Do you need uh, a seal? Some tape. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> She's going like this with her fingers. I know. <laughs> Where is it? Where is it? What? Okay, while she's doing those, I'm just going to look at my notes. Um, yes, like, subscribe, uh, follow, blah, blah, blah. I'm so bad at sharing my little Am links here, you guys. One? Um, yeah, oh, that's go. the wrong one. <laughs> that's my email. So if you're watching me on YouTube, um, that is where you can find me. Just put in Rachel Tessman. You can find me that way. You can also go to my blog post, which will give you links to all my social media. Um, so you can follow me that way. Um, if you are on Facebook, you can find me at Stamp Your Art Out with Rachel. And if you'd like to, while you're on Facebook, visit Terry. She is Sunshine Stamper um, with Terry Phelps. Yeah. Sunshine so. Stamper with Terry Phelps. Did I get it right? Yeah, I think so. I think so. <laughs> <laughs> so you can visit her page too. Check yeah. her out. And I I haven't been doing some stuff for a while, but I'm just getting back into um, stuff. You know, life happens. So, um, yeah. but it's, it's a lot of fun. I do some lives and stuff too, but... Yeah, life does it's happen. Fun. Life that does, is that's the, the beauty of this. This is nice. Yeah. I got glue all over here. Oh, that's thing. fine. That's what it's oh for. My God. So on the back side, you can add your little glimmer strip down oh, there. I was wondering where. I was thinking that was going to be in the bottom front. Yeah. Sweet. And then I'm going to tear this off because we're going to show off these cards against the the white grid paper on the other side. Whoopsie. And I'm going to zoom out just a bit as I get my arm in the screen again. Nice. <laughs> it's all good. All right. So that one fits exactly across the bottom of that white. Space. The very bottom, or do you want a little space? I oh, think I left like a, a eighth bit. of an inch. Of course. Are you sure it wasn't a sixteenth? It might have been a sixteenth. <laughs> Voila! Ta-da! I love the two different sides. So this one was obviously using the So Sincere stamp set. Oh, and this fun. one's using the sentiments that came with the um, Let's Go Shopping stamp set. So two different nice. choices on there. And there we go. Fun! Fun, let's, fun, fun. Let's flip this over so they can see it against just nice, clean oh, white nice. paper. I'll flip it this way. There we go. Okay, and now now we're going to go. I like to angle them. Now we're going to... Now we're going to like put our heads together and smile <laughs> because sometimes Facebook catches these little glimpses along the recording. And then when I save the recording, I can pick which screenshot I want it to save. Oh, sure. So I usually try to pick one where I'm smiling. <laughs> Anyways, um, what, what do we have for news? Oh, um, new kit. So yeah. there's a new kit called Rustic Christmas Countdown. Bring it over to my blog post really quick so you can see that uh, because you don't want to miss out on that. Here we go. Do, 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 do. There. <laughs> so here we are at the store and I'm just going to go over to the what's new and click on that and I'm going to click on new arrivals. New arrivals will bring you to the newest things that are added to the online store and there you can see the rustic Christmas countdown kit. Uh, for $19. If you're a kit lover like me, super pretty. I mean, and look at yeah. all the, like, look at all these pieces. That. You could totally do alternate ideas with that. Like, oh my you gosh. could make cards with it. You could do scrapbooking with it. You could make, um, you know, you, instead of like little, because the, there are three, they're like home decor. You're supposed to put little things mm -hmm. in the pockets, but you could make them into 
uh, tags for gifts. You could make them into bookmarks. You could make them into oh gosh, yeah. all kinds of things, right? You could so, make a little treat box out of it, too. A treat box. Like, you just add the back. Absolutely. You know, depending on how, I don't know how long they are, but... And they're numbered. So you can take and make, like, oh, you know those little yeah. drawers that have the... Um, they got the drawers now in the mini catalog. You could make oh, yeah. a drawer countdown and stick, like, 3D things in there or something. But I'm loving Fine. that. So I wanted to share that with you. I'm going to click back here. Remember that World Card Making Day is the Saturday. If you have not joined the event yet, make sure that you click on the World Card Making Day information on the website at stamp your, um, I'm sorry, at stampinup.com. Um, and they're scrolling through all the little things that are going on right now. There is one that said 35% off, 35% more. That is the starter kit special going on right now. So if you awesome. if you want to join our group, <laughs> you can join with the 35, and it's coming up right really quick here. There it is. Join today. So just click on that and see what it does. Oh, it's joining Stampin' Up. Why join? Blah, blah, blah. Anyways, you can find out more information there. You can also visit my blog. I'm going to go over there and any blog posts that I have, if you scroll to the bottom, well, here I talked about it because it was new and fresh, but if you scroll underneath my signature, you can find links. There's my signature right there. You can find links to all the specials going on and the 35% more or 35% off basically is one of the best kit offers I've seen in a long time. I know. I was like, what? Yeah, it is. <laughs> it's really good. And if you don't want to do what we do, you don't feel like doing Facebook Lives or you don't feel like selling to your friends, it's totally fine because over 90% of the demonstrators that get the starter kit do it because they want the discount. How many yeah. of you have done that with other companies before? You've gotten the kit because you love the products. Well, it's a great reason and you shouldn't feel guilty for doing it. So feel free to um, you know, reward purchase yourself. the starter kit. Yeah, yeah if you're and gonna buy it anyway, reward yourself. Exactly, and, you know, exactly. And if you buy enough like I do, you get paid for it too. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it's a win-win, <laughs> you know? True, true. Here's that uh, rustic Christmas, but I'm just gonna scroll up because here, oh, I don't think I wrote it in there. Um, I Like if you click on the links, to learn more there's like a learn more thing it'll bring you on my website to where it actually tells you the exact amount so that's pretty cool like how much do you really get so let's go here first and then i'll go to that spot online exclusives we're giving you a teaser right now because demonstrators like terry and i we get to pre-order some stuff that's going to appear in the online store on november 7th new mm -hmm. um additions to the online exclusives and for anybody who's getting the starter kit you can you, pick from it. You can. You can add those things. So I'm going to click here for more details. Oh, what did it do? Oh, it brought me here. Okay. <laughs> That's exactly where I wanted to go. Oh, and this is this is the... We're on a, a blog hop. Did I tell you that? We're on a blog hop um, with the All-Star Group right now. So this wonderful bundle of video classes is available for purchase or for earning. You can click on that link and learn more about it. But here is where you'll learn more about the starter kit. There it is. It is in the US, either $125 in product and you only pay $64.35. Yeah. Or, or what's the other one? $99 and you get $165.75 in product. $168. Oh, 168. 160. I high five you oh, with my left my hand. Oh my God. <laughs> I, I had a freak out for a second. I thought, oh no, I'm going to hurt her hand. You I know? know. Did you? Like, yeah. Yeah. Like, okay. um, and then also, there. that's why it's even better of a deal because they're also allowing you to be online with us on November 11th for the On Stage at Home yeah. virtual convention, which is a $77 value. That's for free. Um, and I had to pay for it. <laughs> I did too. I know, right? We pay for it. What? Should we, should we like like not join and then like join again? We can't. We can't. Because we're having too much fun. Well, sure. I mean, you could, but I'm not going to. I'm not going <laughs> to. Um, but yes, the video class bundle is um, available now. So you'll want to check that out. It's the October video class bundle. And this is a close-up of the project that I made that contributed towards that kit. And all of these people here are blog hopping today. So at 4 o'clock p.m. Central Time, you'll be able to click on the, on the um, blog post link, but also get connected to all these other people's blogs because 
We're all hopping together and we're sharing different ideas with the Lay Shop Suite. So I hope that you enjoyed the ideas that we shared today. Okay, so let's go to prizes. Oh, da, yeah. da, 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 da. <laughs> These are prizes that were offered last time I was live, which was two weeks ago. I was live last week, but I was just sharing, um, what was I doing? I was sharing cards, cards that people gave to me. I think and so. then so two weeks ago, when we were doing the demonstration online part, uh, paper crafting class, this was the prize that was given out to the live winners. It's a pack of envelopes and a choice of embellishments. You can see the different choices here. This is what's left. So I have two winners, and those two winners, let me go over to... <sighs> Where is it, Rachel? <laughs> this one, okay. So we have winners from Facebook. Ta-da! Pam Reno. Congratulations, Pam. And I've also picked a second person from uh, Facebook. And that is Kim Torkelson. Oh, you know what? These weren't the prizes from last time. It was a tutorial. Who cares? I'm giving out these. You have a choice because <laughs> I just messed up. You can choose either a tutorial or you can choose an envelope, an embellishment pack. Sorry, we did a tutorial last time. These people get extra <laughs> choices. So Kim Torkelson, congrats, and Pam Reno, congrats. Plus, we have a YouTube After Live commenter. We have Renee Gines. So all three of you, I do have extras, so it will all go a long way. We'll figure it out. Okay, so tutorial choices yes. or whatever. Now we're going to go back to us for a minute so we can adjust the desktop. And we're going to click on live streaming because we have to see what Trisha chooses for prize winners because she's going to pick out the live prize winners for us. Nice. And those people get, and we're going to bring those pe papers. papers back over, yeah. And you get a sheet of the um, glow-in-the-dark paper. You get some wobbles. Um, you oh, get yeah, wobbles. a quarter of a pack of the, um, oh, yeah, we got to show it oh. to them. <laughs> <laughs> the delightful floral or whatever this is stuff called. This yeah. pretty paper. I think it's delightful floral. Okay. So, yeah, you get a choice of embellishments. You get some wobbles. You get a sheet of the glow-in-the-dark. And you get, you, you get what I said, right? <laughs> there or, they are. Or you get, um, what do you call them? Oops. Click on it. <laughs> oh, yeah. The glow in the dark. Yeah, the glow in the we dark. just don't show that right now. And there are the names of the winners. We have Rosemary Johnson and Trudy Parmer. Parmer? Pamar. Pa Parmar. 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 I don't know how to say it, Trudy. You're going to have to, like, correct me when you email me. So, Yay. congratulations to the winners. You are so right. Yay. Congrats, Renee. Congrats. Woohoo. I love it. <laughs> I love it. All the all the winners are getting announced here. And then, oh, here's my email. So if you would please contact me at stampyourartout.comcast.net so you can claim your prize. That's the only way you can claim it is if you email me. Although some people have ways of contacting me other ways, but I sometimes miss them. I do. So please email oh, yeah. me. I check my email all the time. Um, I just want to announce a couple pr past prize winners who have not claimed their prizes yet. We have Maureen Rosenbaum, um, you got a tutorial. Uh, S Susan Clement, you got um, envelopes and bling. And Chris Rademacher, you got envelopes and bling. So please reach out to me if I called out your name as well. So, yay. What do you think? Was it Super fun? Super fun. <laughs> thank you so much. I thank you, it. Trisha and Lisa. Thank you also <laughs> for helping. Thank you all for coming. I hope that you had a fabulous time. My next live will be next week. I have a feeling because they're making me do some really scary exercises this week that I will be using my middle finger a little bit more. <laughs> <laughs> and um, so, but wouldn't we like to have her back some other time, you guys? <laughs> That'd be you, fun. It would be. It would be a lots of fun. Thank you so much, Terry. Oh, no. You're a blessing. Thank you. No, you're a blessing. <laughs> you're a blessing to so many. Mm. Thank you. All right. Well, I'm going to let you guys go. Next week, my live is on Wednesday, Og October 11th. Gosh, you guys, it's October. <laughs> October 11th at 11 a.m. Central oh, Time. Gosh. I know, right? Okay. So I'm going to let you guys all go because I'm getting teary-eyed. Well, take care, oh. everybody. Bye-bye. <laughs> Stamp Hi. your art out. Okay. And all that jazz. Bye. <laughs>